Okay, I am with Pharaoh, right? That's right. Pharaoh, what made you dress up like that? Um, well, it was actually last minute though, but uh, that's mainly the reason why. Are you Jewish? No, I'm not. Okay. What do you know about Pharaoh? Pharaoh is an ancient king of Egypt. Uh-huh. And uh, he was a ruler of, uh, of uh, many people. Do you know what the Bible says about Pharaoh and Moses and how God had to yes. use Moses and, and send uh, to harden Pharaoh's heart? Yes. What do you believe about the Bible? Do you uh, believe it's true? About oh, Of course it is, yeah. I completely. So you believe about heaven, hell, stuff like that, eternity? Absolutely. Where are you going, Pharaoh, when you die? I'm, I'm going to heaven. Why, Pharaoh? Because are you a good pharaoh? I am uh, I'm a pharaoh in disguise. <laughs> would you consider yourself to be a good pharaoh? I would be a good pharaoh if I was back then. Let, let's see how good you are in the eyes of God, okay? One of, uh, you've heard of the Ten Commandments, right? Yes. It says that we shouldn't lie. Have you ever lied before? Many times. It yeah. says we shouldn't steal. Have you ever stolen before? Many times. It says that we shouldn't take God's name in vain. Have you ever done that? I've Yes. All right. One more. It says that we shouldn't commit adultery. Now, you're not married, are you? No. Have you ever, Jesus said, if you look at a woman and lust for her, you've committed adultery within your heart. Have you ever done that, Pharaoh? I probably have. So, if you were to stand before God on Judgment Day, would you be innocent or guilty for breaking those laws, Pharaoh? I would be, uh, I'll be. You broke the laws. (laughs) Yes, I would break the laws. So, where would you go, Pharaoh, heaven or hell? I'll probably go to heaven. Why? Because I would forget, I would forget, I would uh, repent, and uh, and and that's. And so I'll, it's just on repenting, then just saying, God, I'm sorry, and then turn around, go back, do it again. Sorry, go back, do it again. Sorry. So we can kind of just use God as like a sugar daddy, right? Would that be fair? No. So then, just repentance alone can't. God can't forgive you, right? You need a fine payer to pay your fine. You know who that fine payer was? No, Jesus. There you go. He died on the cross, Pharaoh, for your sins. And you could go to heaven, not because you're a good person, but because you're a bad person forgiven by a good good God. But you have to repent of your sin and put your faith and trust in the Savior, Jesus Christ. That's what the Bible talks about, where sin entered the world, but God wanted to save the world from their sins through his son, Jesus Christ. And that's the good news. That's what the whole thing of the Bible is, is all about. Sin came in the world. God said, I'm going to make a way to destroy sin, conquer sin, defeat sin. And that was through his son, Jesus Christ. But you can only get to heaven through him. Not by trying to be a good person, because you're not good in God's eyes. Neither am I. I'm a filthy, wretched sinner. But I need a savior just like you. Would you at least think about that? Yes. Now listen, I want to give you this. When you get a chance, read it. It talks about heaven and hell, all right? All right, And be safe and have a good night. Take care. All right, take care.